order up for my chicken Romano? Elaine Bolt says she loves her job as a waitress. I love people. When they leave here, they are relaxed. This is how Elaine relaxes. <laughs> Elaine is a member of Girls With Guns. They come from all walks of life, ages 25 to 75, and share one thing in common. What they call... I think I got them through the heart that time. ...the shooting sport. Yeah, it's a social ladies club, except we shoot. People just don't think I can't shoot because I'm little. The group meets once a month at Fletcher Arms in Waukesha, and it's grown from two women to more than 70. I was so happy I went to a, a restaurant, which my girlfriend owns, and I told her, I just bought my first gun, I'm so excited. And she said, you did? I want to learn to shoot. And then it multiplied. It multiplied so much that the county clerk herself heard about it and joined in on the fun. Being able to um, meet other women that are also going to um, go through that class on um, concealed carry and, and understand how to use a gun properly, I think that's important. Salesman and instructor Mike Sylvester says ever since the concealed carry law passed in Wisconsin, packing heat has become very popular among women. Approximately 40 percent of the people taking the concealed classes are women. I haven't decided which one's going to be my carry. Girls with guns aren't the only ones dropping these magazines for these. I came to take a look for myself across town in West Dallas where women shoot free all Tuesday long. Lack of female shooters and just decided this might be something to uh, help get them started. I think it's awesome. I think it could be the new ladies night. Of course, we'll come here before we go out for our drinks, so. <laughs> Safety. I can protect myself and my family. Fun. Impresses, man, that's for sure. Whatever the reason. I'm just more of a tomboy. Their message is clear. Get training, practice, and be comfortable. If you're not comfortable, don't have it. With a handgun on one arm and a handbag on the other, these girls call it a night. Reporting in Milwaukee, Laura Rodriguez, 10 at 10.